Big screens, computers, and digital images are all part of the electronic mission for these Wayne County fifth graders. They spent a week learning math and science skills in a 21st century way. Teacher Alan Perry says the e-mission was a great way to engage students. Students are just uh, working in groups. We put them in teams of uh, uh, five teams of five students apiece and uh, they have to learn and become experts on different planets in the solar system and, and what the e-mission is is there's a lost spaceship somewhere in space and they have to uh, learn all the data and be able to do calculations and things in order to rescue the, the spaceship. Perry, who teaches at the high school level during the academic year, says working as a science coordinator for this project has been a rewarding experience. I'm a, a high school science teacher, so the, the science part wasn't difficult with me, but I've had so much help from everybody with the, the Harla Center. We all work together as a team, so uh, it's, it's really re went real well. Uh, Wayne County provided the facilities and and lunches for all the students, so it's really been a team effort on everybody's part. Perry isn't the only one who's pleased with this summer's online learning camps. Lead teacher Debbie Workman says there are plans to expand. This is the first year that, that we have done space camp. It won't be our last. We're really excited about it. We got started a little bit late, um, but still have had uh, three full weeks of full camps. So have had a lot of interest for middle school, so next year we do hope to include middle school in our program. The June Harless Center for Rural Education is geared toward providing leadership in education initiatives to West Virginia's teachers and students with a specific emphasis on rural areas. For We Are Marshall Today, I'm Leah Edwards.